here. <laughs> He just said he's seen a change in your practice habits this year. Um, what are some of the things you've changed, I guess? Uh, just my mentality to finish. I mean, just finishing on plays. Like, I could be like, last year I know I'd be like, oh, I was there. And then, like, I'll be like, I was there, but not go finish the play. But then they'll show up in the game like, oh, I'm saying I'm there. And they still catch it. Stuff like that. So just finish it. Is that kind of the mentality of, of this team in the bye week is to finish? Right. I mean, it's the start and finish. For, um, that's our mentality because last year we came off of our bye week playing against Mississippi State. We didn't do too good. I mean, not good at all. So our mentality this week, just finish the start and finish. So. Is, it, is it harder to, to go through a bye week in, after a loss to let, sit on that for an extra week? That, that was I think that was really hard because you'd be so ready to, like, when we lost, like, we played a hell of a game, but – you so ready to get back into it, to prove that's not who you were, or like just erase the erase the mistakes, uh, erase what happened to you, so you can hurry up and get another win, so it just wash over. But yeah, sitting out that whole week, yeah. <laughs> Randy got something in store. We got something in store for him. How uh, the defense? Y'all had some great numbers so far this year, mm -hmm. but. You know, the coaches keep talking about there's still room for improvement. Where, where's the room for improvement? How do you get better from the first half? I mean, we you never can be satisfied with what you've done. Like, I know we got, like, Josh probably got, like, six sacks. Why, why he can't get eight, you know, stuff like that. So we can always get better. Like, and it's some stuff we left on the field. Like, with those wins and that loss, we left some things on the field, some plays that were broken and stuff like that. So we can always fix our communication, fix finishing the plays, and – just leave it all on the field. Saturday could be the sixth win. Have you ever even thought about bowl eligibility? Uh, I mean, we th I mean, it's in the, it's in our heads. So like, when we get our if we get our win and stuff like that, we got the potential to be bowl eligible early. You know, we don't do that too often, but yeah, it's in our heads. So, <laughs> Josh said with the seniors in the secondary that everyone's you know trying to get paid. So I guess to that point, was there a moment that it took for you that you know this is your last year and kind of your last audition for I mean as soon as the season was over last year I knew this was my last year so I mean I'm sure everybody felt like that you know so as soon as the season was over we was back at it we was working are teams throwing away from you have you noticed that on film when you're <laughs> I don't want to say that I just think uh, I mean I'm 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 just working harder so like it looked like I'm on the receivers more and stuff like that so I don't, <laughs> don't want to comment on that <laughs> <laughs> You, you mentioned Josh, you know, he has six sacks, why not eight sacks? What's your stats? What are what are the things that you need to see go up or down? Uh, I want to improve on tackling. I mean, I missed a tackle in Texas A&M. It hurt my feelings. <laughs> uh, I mean, I only got one interception. So, I mean, I, I want more interceptions. So, that's something I want to see go up. You only missed one tackle? <laughs> in, in the A&M game. <laughs> like in that room when there's so many guys who are veterans I mean is it easy is it more complicated is it more fun like what is it we got so many personalities in it like so <laughs> it, it's fun so like and then it, it burn the edge we got people who love to compete in us so everything is a competition oh. down to oh I dress better than you today <laughs> so like so if you get a, a PBU in a game or a tackle in a game like the man next to you is like oh I'm gonna one up you so the competition level makes it better so it's, it's fun in there but it is I mean with all our personalities it's crazy in there. what is it about Darius that everybody sort of flocks to I mean he's a guy that been through it you know like Darius missed probably three seasons well last year was his first real season yeah. so he been here three years before that so like it's like and then he just like lead by example so with Darius being out so long like no one no one really saw him or anything, but he always had to work ethic. Like in the weight room, he's the most explosive player we got. So we just see all that work ethic and it's transpiring on the field. You'd be like, I just want to be like that. So that's what it is.